Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today uh, I'm in the Helsinki airport and I have a little bit of time so I thought I would film a few videos for you guys. Um, the first video is uh, the traveler tag because um, that's what I do and I thought it would be fun to film. If you like travel or fashion, um, feel free to subscribe because that's what I do and let's get on to the video. My first traveling plane was when I was 10. I was going to see my family in England and I was traveling alone actually so it was it was quite cool. Um, I remember I was like the only children underage there and um, they sat me next to an old woman who told to me about her son or something. So yeah, um, it was when I was 10 and I was traveling alone. Is Miami! I absolutely love my stay in Miami. Of course, I, it had a whole context of um, I was studying there and I was with friends and stuff. But I don't know. It's just it was a really cool weekend, and I'd love to go back there. Um, I think I would go to Dubai and like live the fast Dubai fast life and like take Arabic courses and learn the language and everything and like really see what it's like to run the Dubai life. I would love that. But I don't have an limited amount of money, so that's gonna have to wait. Um, if it's day, plane. If it's night, boat. My grandma's house. To St. Petersburg, because right now I'm going to a place in Finland that is six hours away with boat from St. Petersburg, so I think that's what I would go next. South Korea, um, Skyscanner and Rome to Rio. Skyscanner is great if you know your date and if uh, you have a low budget because it shows you the best destination for your budget and yeah. And Rome to Rio is amazing because if you know your, your place of leaving and your destination you actually can see the best way to go there and they makes the means of transportation so it's just not it's not just flight or just train it shows you everything that's really practical i would say if i know i'm going to sleep and it's like a long flight i would say window but if it's a flight where i'm scared of like crashing or something then a uh, rope how I pass time while traveling, while I film videos, I edit videos, or I listen to music. I'm not a big, I don't read when I'm traveling because it gets me really sick. So I avoid travel, I avoid reading, but yeah, mostly um, filming videos, editing them, or listening to music. I think it's 14, but I'm not sure, I'll just write it down there, but I think it's 14. I would do a road trip in the USA and do like the best thrift shop there. I absolutely loved um, thrift shopping in the USA, so I would love to do that. And I would say Airbnb. Before traveling, I don't look up too much the culture because I don't want to have too many prejudices. However, I do look up in France. We have um, ambassadors' websites to see like what are the security rules and like the culture rule we have to know. So um, I look this up like that, I have like the, the must know information and I don't um, have my own vision blurred by prejudices and stuff. And also I kind of like to like go through the main points of history just to avoid like awkward moments of like saying something really stupid. Weird, the first, I'm going to say two of them, the first is kind of random, is the um, the building in Miami where the Cuban immigrants would come through. I just It just made a massive impression on me. And also the Berlin Wall, because when you know the culture of Berlin Wall, it's just really impressive. So yeah, that was it for me today. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you next week with the new travel and fashion videos. Until then, have fun. Yeah, bye guys.